Hi, today I want to introduce a very good stuff. A subcompact pistol flashlight, Vade Scrapper flashlight. It fits for the subcompact pistols very well. 500 lumens smart sensors switch and the magnetic magnetic charger on the back it's brief inspection specifications okay let's do the unboxings brief instruction user menu we will update it into a booklet style flashlight very compact very compact wire cable charger set usb magnetic port i will tell you how to use that hex key and the two pieces of the anti retreat insertion okay let me take it out now we'll notice it's very compact size has two switch on both sides one on the left the other is on the right this one is for smart sensor smart sensor switch that one is the click on off switch let's have a quick start to see on click again off on off the flashlight has three model strong medium and low when it is on you press it for one second again one second let's check one second medium and that's the low medium high yeah that's the strongest brightness let's let's let me do it again let me off let me light it on first. Yeah. Low, medium. Oh, I didn't. Higher, low, medium, higher. Or you can hold it. So it automatically changed the different modes. When you like it, when you want to choose one style, it just release it. Okay, that's the mediums. And then I will tell you how to use the smart sensors. If you put your fingers on it and remove it, it will be on immediately. You hold it, it will be off. You remove it, it will be on. Very silent operation, no click sound. That's so tactical. Do you think so? Let's check it again. Off, on, off, on, silent, without any sound. Good. Okay, let's turn off. Now, let me tell you how to use the anti retreat insertion. You have different, we know that we have different of the sub combat pistol in the world. They have a different of the I mean of the slot positions. Some is very close to the barrel and some is very far. Okay? So you need to have different 
of the, I mean the position of the anti-retraction, anti-retreat insertions. You just press here. Oh, sorry. Okay, that's the one position. That's the one position. And then, yeah, you see, the insertions is moved to the front. Of course, we can turn it around. Now we notice it's to the back on these positions. Yeah. That one is the charger port that we need to connect to the wire cable. This. Let's release it. One to the power bank. One to the power bank. As I said, it's magnetic. See? Very easy of use. Automatically. Yep. Now we notice it has a charging indicator here. It shows, tells it's the yellow. We have three colors. One is red, one is yellow, and one is the green. If greens show, if greens light tells the power, I mean the battery the battery capacity is more than 75%. Yellow is 25 to 75%. If the light is in red, then it tells the battery capacity is lower than 25%. Now, that's the yellow, okay? That means the battery capacity now for the flashlight is about 25 to 75%. Quite easy of use. The battery run time, let's see, that's the medium. Strong, if you light it in strong, it can last about 10 to 12 minutes. If it is, I mean, in 500 lumens, the light can be light 10 to 12 minutes. If the light is in medium, it about 35 minutes. Oh, that's the low, that's the low, sorry. Yeah, medium, that's the medium. Median is 35 minute battery run time. Strong is 10 minutes. Low can reach, I mean the low light brightness is about 40 lumens. 40 lumens. It can about, it can be about 4.5 hours. 4.5 hours. That's the brightest. That's the brightest. 500 lumens. 40 lumens. 200 lumens. 200 lumens if it's set in the medium, about 35 minute battery run times. And this one 
is the motion smart sensor switch. Cover it will be off. Release will be light on. Yeah. Quite easy of use. Now you can find this flashlight on our website. Yeah, vector optics.com or you can directly visit vape.com to see the product and know the details of course if you have any questions you can email us or leave any comment that's no problem anyway thanks for watching bye bye